We've talked about natural shoulder anatomy, the development of the RSA in France, how it went from failure to significant improvement through a reaction to design change, namely a medialized Gramont component. And in this chapter, we're going to talk about how do we make that better. If you look at the original French design, which had a higher failure rate that was then acceptable, and because of that, they went to a medialized component, there are some really nice aspects of it. Namely, the center of rotation is more anatomic. And anytime you go more anatomic, things tend to be better. So an American surgeon said, well, I really like this aspect of the lateralized glenosphere. If it's a lateralized glenosphere, it's more natural, and potentially I can improve some problems that we see in patients with a Grammont style reverse. Namely, that the arm becomes medialized and placed distally. And what that does is, because it's a non-anatomic medialized center of rotation, certain uh, intact soft tissues, namely the posterior rotator cuff, may be detentioned, and it may not be able to work at the ideal length. Practically speaking, that means that we can't get as much active external rotation as we want. And that's a very important feature. People need the external rotation to reach the back of the head, to feed themselves, and for daily activities of normal life. In addition, when you have a medialized center of rotation for an RSA, the cosmesis becomes different. The arm looks a little boxier, the arms tend to be a little bit lengthened. And that becomes an issue for patients where clothes don't fit as naturally. Suits have to be tailored or lengthened. Bra straps may not sit the way they're supposed to and may constantly fall. And these are subtle issues, but very important issues. So how do we fix this? Well, if we lateralize our center of rotation, we can tension the posterior rotator cuff and get our active external rotation. If we lateralize the center of rotation or lateralize our glenosphere, we can potentially improve the cosmesis, a more rounded shoulder instead of the boxy shoulder, a more normal arm length than the longer arms that uh, I personally have seen in uh, medialized center of rotation implants. So I think the lateralized design is, is a nice evolutionary step in terms of uh, reverse shoulder replacements, but it really, you have to get some key biomechanical factors and good fixation in order to get those additional benefits.